Money is laundered to conceal illegal activity to include the crime that generates it, such as drug trafficking. Financial institutions have been a witting and unwitting participant in these laundering activities. Banks in particular have been major targets in anti-laundering operations because they offer a wide variety of services and instruments which are used to disguise the source, ownership, or control of illicit funds. The investigator begins by accessing the report directly from the landing page and can easily review its contents. Advanced analytical capabilities allow the relevant unstructured data to easily be ingested into the system for further analysis. Using simple and intuitive steps, the investigator can analyze the initial data for evidence of criminality. Here he discovers that the suspicious transactions in the Miami-based account actually occurred in New York. Additional analysis reveals that over $300,000 were deposited into an account via three different branches, all within short walking distance and in less than one hour's time. Using research tools which are customizable to the individual user's needs and workflows, the investigator can quickly add more information which was obtained via subpoena about associated accounts. Powerful presentation utilities allow the investigator to arrange the data in a logical format and ferret out yet more information. Here he readily sees that four different individuals have opened a series of seven accounts at various banks. The investigator has the ability to examine single or multiple transactions as the needs in the investigation dictate. Here the investigator has identified a series of structured deposits in Chicago that were subsequently forwarded in aggregate to the Miami-based account. The ability to rapidly access and analyze large volumes of data from disparate sources, the investigator identifies an additional series of structured deposits in yet another account that were aggregated and transferred to the target Miami account. Deepening the level of analysis, the investigator can easily understand the mechanisms of the transaction and how the money was placed and layered. He also uncovers the common link, in this case the Collins Avenue address that connects the individual subject that he identified earlier in the process and is able to gather additional evidence. Palantir's ability to interface with multiple non-proprietary databases and use their information in a single workspace provides time-saving analytical support and minimizes the investigator's learning curve by concentrating on a single all-purpose platform that achieves results and allows the investigator to follow the money trail. Armed with the right information and an ideal platform which allows for timely and effective analysis of large data sets, the investigator is able to wind his way through the complex labyrinth that is the money laundering process. He is in short order able to uncover and identify the source, ownership, or control of illicit funds. It is worth noting that while this presentation demonstrates the power of detailed analysis with limited open source data, an investigation with the full data set possessed by organizations such as the Department of the Treasury, Federal Bureau of Investigations, and other community stakeholders could yield countless opportunities to enhance effectiveness in the decision-making process, streamline inefficiencies, and identify weak links. In other words, help managers and decision makers build a more efficient program across the enterprise in real time.